Hey guys, welcome back or welcome to my channel. My name is Angela and in today's video, I'll be showing you guys my very first tattoos. Yes, I'm doing a tattoo tour today. This is my very first, like I'm 28 years old and I've never had tattoos in my entire life. And I just decided for the first time in my life to get tattoos, not one not two, but four. I just decided to have four tattoos all at once. Going into tattoos, I already knew what I wanted, the designs, the meanings. A little disclaimer, I do not think that all tattoos have to have meanings, but for me personally, I do feel like that. So it's not for other people. Like you can have any tattoos or any designs you want. If you really like the aesthetic, it is your body and it is your decision. But for me personally, all my tattoos have have meanings I really took tattoos seriously and even though I wanted them my whole life I really gave some designs and some meanings a lot of time and I'm talking about years it was kind of a test like I would know what I want for my tattoos and then I would give it like a couple years to see after a couple years if I still like that and I am so happy that I did this because there were actually some tattoo designs or some tattoos that I wanted to get like a couple years ago but then looking back now I'm like oh my gosh I'm so happy that I didn't do that and with these tattoos I've been thinking about it for a long time some longer than others the thing is like it will stay on your body for a lifetime so you definitely want to make sure that you've really thought about it and I mean there's no shade to people that just want to get like a tattoo just for fun like a random tattoo like that's really cool like I wish I could do that but I can't so for me that was a process I thought about about these tattoos for a long time and after a while I was like yeah I've been thinking about this for a while I'm still not sick of it and I just want to get it tattooed on my body and the first one I got is this one on my wrist and um, I'll show you guys in the clip so you can see it better. This is a matching tattoo with my best friend, Jeannie. We decided we want an eye because we love the aesthetic. And for us, it just means that we always like keep an eye on each other. Like we, we have each other's back, like we look out for each other. So that is the meaning of this tattoo. Funny enough though, I have a second meaning for this tattoo as well. My family's name is Nazar and in Turkey, that means evil eye and the evil I represents protection from evil so I really really love this tattoo I chose it to have it in the front so if I'm just like posing from the side like you will see it and I am really really happy with this tattoo I love the thin lines for all my tattoos almost I have like thin lines because that's just the aesthetic that I like so for this tattoo because it was my first one I was super nervous I was like oh my gosh what is happening I just didn't know what to expect and I have a very low pain tolerance. I have to admit though, from all four tattoos that I got in one seating, I do have to say that this is probably the most painful which is kind of weird because there is like you know some skin here but somehow this was the most painful for me i think i would rate it like a five and a five seems pretty high but i think also with my nerves and not knowing what it feels like it was just like kind of nerve-wracking for me what i also really love about this placement is that um it's perfect even though i'm wearing a watch it doesn't cover it and it just makes it look very very pretty so the second one i got is uh, the number 11 on my right wrist and this is in a old english font and it is a outline so the meaning behind this tattoo is very special for me because it is for my parents my parents are both born in november i do have to say this one was a little bit last minute i knew that i wanted a tattoo for my parents and first i was thinking i want to get their birthday and then 11 in Roman numerals and have it like on the outside but then I just decided that maybe in the future I want something here on the outside that is like lettering and then I think it was like three nights before uh, our appointment I was talking with my husband and I was like babe like what do you think if I just get like 
the number 11 because the number 11 it is like November it stands for November and I really like that it's like one one so it kind of represents my parents as like two individuals yeah that was just kind of like the thought behind it and I'm very happy that I got this one it is very simple it is a quite small but it is actually my favorite tattoo like I just love the placement I look at it when I'm on my phone I just see it and then I think about my parents for like the pain level i would probably say this was not painful at all this was literally done in like five minutes or something five to ten i would probably say like a two like to be honest i barely felt this one now the third tattoo that i got is the letter f but the f is actually a tattoo that i wanted to get with my husband and uh, it also has two meanings the first meaning is my cat fufu and my cat fufu passed away um about i think two or almost three months ago and it was very very hard for me and it was a big loss it's still hard for me to talk about it but i really really loved my cat so much like she has been through a lot with me and she was there when i was alone when i was kind of going through depression and then when I was all by myself. When she passed away, we were just devastated and heartbroken. And we chose this particular F because it is also a music symbol. It represents forte, which means loud in the music term. The F just represents fufu and my love for music. So that is a very, very special tattoo to us. And I chose to have it on my ankle. She would just always like rub her body and her head against our ankles. And it kind of like makes me think of her when she was being clinging with me. Oh my gosh, it's getting so emotional. But yes, that is a very special tattoo for me as well. I feel like that was probably the fastest tattoo. That was only about, I'm telling you guys, like three minutes or something that was like super fast that one was a little bit more painful i think because there's more like bones there so i would rate it probably a four like a four out of ten all right and then the last tattoo and um i mean you can kind of see it here but i will show you a clip of course and that is the letter j and i also got it in the english old font it is just my favorite font i think it's so classic i just love the aesthetic of it and the j uh, stands for my husband jordan and i just love this because you know i love my neck kisses too and i always liked the placement of behind the ear so yes guys that is my complete tattoo tour of 2022 so comment down below if you have tattoos or if you're thinking about getting any and i would love to see you guys in the next video bye